<laughs> the sun is waking up, it's a new shiny day. Time to laugh and learn as we sing and we play. Baby Ricky time! Baby Ricky time! Learning, rhyming, always smiling, baby Ricky time! Yeah. Finding out new things every place that we go. The more we learn, the more we try, the more that we grow. Hey, baby Ricky time! Baby Ricky time! Happy hopping, never stopping, baby, baby Ricky, Ricky time! time. That's us. Pyramids. Hello, children. Chi Chi, it looks like you're building a pyramid, is that right? Hello there. Ugh. Yes, a pyramid. Huh, huh, huh. I want a pyramid too. Huh? Huh? Aha! I'll be right back. Huh, huh. This one and this one. I'll make a huge pyramid. Huh? Huh? Hmm. Huh? 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 Oh. Huh? Hmm. Why are they falling? Crashy! I can do it. Look. Stop falling! <laughs> oh no. Crashy is getting a bit upset. Oh. 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 You silly thing! Ah. Silly, silly thing! Oh, are huh. you feeling a little bit upset, Crashy? Yes, I am upset. Ah. Very upset. But why? The pyramid keeps falling. I can't get it right. Oh, dear, Crashy. I'm sorry you're feeling upset. I'll tell you a secret. When something doesn't go my way, I get upset too. Huh? Mm-hmm. Everyone gets upset at times, but you can't stay upset forever. You have to try and try again. Will you help me, Chi-Chi, please? Yes, OK. Thank you. Ha-ha! <laughs> oh, can you hold this, please? Ha-ha. <laughs> It looks like there is only one more piece to go. Yes! <laughs> You're not upset anymore, <sighs> Crashy. And you and Chi Chi have made a great pyramid together. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> Feeling upset. Uh, uh, Are you upset, uh, Crashy? Uh, yes, I am. But why? Because my jewelry didn't turn out right. Oh. <sighs> Sometimes when we're playing, our ball might roll away And sometimes when we're playing Our toy blocks might not stay Then it makes us feel really quite upset And we want to show those toys who's the boss Ooh. And because we are upset We will stomp our little feet And after feeling upset We can laugh and feel a beat <laughs> Are you still feeling upset, Crashy? Not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> we felt a little upset. <laughs> Our elephant. Jump, jump, 
Jump! 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 <laughs> Hello, <laughs> children. <laughs> Hello there. Jump! Jump! Uh oh. Oh, it's mud. It's not mud, Chi Chi. <laughs> it's clay. What do you do with clay? You can use wet clay to make things. Come on. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Over there. Okay. <laughs> A ball. <laughs> A pancake. Wet clay is very soft. You have to be careful when you are making oh. things with it. Huh? Huh? A turtle! Be careful! It's clay! It's so squished! That's not a turtle. Uh, is it a dinosaur? It's a dinosaur! Uh, it's, it's not a dinosaur. dinosaur. Now it's an elephant. Oh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Look! <laughs> Careful, don't squish it. Yes, children. Wet clay is very squishy and also very messy. I think it's time to get cleaned up. There, all clean. Let's go see your elephant. Huh? <gasps> Be, careful. Be careful! Be careful! Stop! Stop. Stop. Wet clay! It will get squished. What are you talking about? It's not squishy. It's hard. It's like a rock. The wet clay has dried out and turned hard. And hard enough for you to ride on your elephant. You can even paint and decorate it. <laughs> Ooh! Ha-ha! Off we go! Now that you know how to play with the clay, the next time you can make more things. Maybe a friend for your elephant. Clay. There! It's a vase made out of clay. There are so many things around that are made of clay. Clay dug from the ground. And shaped so perfectly Use your hands to work the clay Create something from the heart It may be something simple Or a work of art Or something useful Like a jug Or a great big mug A bird a frog! A pretty pottery hog! That's even big enough to hug! There are so many things around That are made of clay Clay dug from the ground And shaped so perfectly You can make anything you wish It could be simple like this dish just grab some clay and try. Picture something in your mind's eye. There's so much you could make. It could be something really great. Like a nightingale so cute. Or an angelic sounding flute. That's us! The present. Hello, Pandy. Hello. What have you got there? Shh. It's a picture of Chi-Chi. Oh, how lovely. Are you going to give it to Chi-Chi? Yes, it's a present. Hello, Chi-Chi. I have a present for you. Oh, wow. Thank you. <laughs> it is so nice to get a present. And it's even nicer to give them. Oh. What are you thinking about, Chi-Chi? I would really like to give a nice present to Pandy as well. 
That's a lovely idea. What will you give her? I don't know. Hmm, let's think. What does Pandy really like? Oh, some flowers. Hmm, maybe, but I'm not sure how you're going to get those flowers. I can't reach them. Maybe there is another way you can reach them. Huh? Careful, Chi-Chi. That does not look very safe. <laughs> I didn't know. They were so big. They are big. They only looked small before because you were so far away. How did you get up there? First I climbed on the box. <sighs> and then onto the box. And then on the... Oh, the plank. I wanted to give you a present. A present? For me? <laughs> yes, a gift for you. But it didn't work out. Chi-Chi, are you sure Pandy doesn't like your present? Here I go. What do you think Pandy is so happy about? <laughs> That's what she likes, climbing. And crawling. Chi-Chi, it turns out that you built Pandy a fantastic present. A place to climb. <laughs> and a place to crawl. <laughs> <laughs> climbing and crawling. <laughs> little girls and little boys love to climb around like monkeys crawling about on all fours over gardens over floors down on hands and on knees across grass and through the leaves we can overcome any obstacle anything is possible anything is possible i'll get down four around scrambling all over the ground clamber up on top ever higher never stop under blanket over sheet using all your hands and feet under the bed you don't know who you'll meet i'll crawl 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 see the snake on the rock and this beetle's easy to spot Try to copy how they move It's a fun thing to do Little girls, little girls. and little boys, and little boys Love to climb around like monkeys Crawling about on all fours Over gardens, over floors down on, hands, Down on hands and on knees, and on knees across grass and, and through, through the leaves. leaves. We can overcome any obstacle. Anything, Anything is possible. That's us! Window. Hello, children. Hello. Hello there. Oh, what a lovely house you have. It's my house. It's so beautiful. Yes, it is. Whoa, whoa. <gasps> oh, the wind is very strong. We will have to hide from it. Oh, no. <gasps> oh. That's better. Yes, it's better. But I can't see anything. You'll need to cover the window with something that's see-through. Clear. Hmm? See-through? Oh, I know. <laughs> Tape. Tape? Yes, Chi-Chi, you're right. It is clear, but... Hooray! Let's put tape on the window! 
It works! And I can still see. Oh! <laughs> The tape wasn't the best choice. Let's find something else see through. <laughs> Chi Chi! Look! What is it? It's smooth and see through. That's a glass window, children. Window? Will a window work? <laughs> oh, it works! We did a great job! How wonderful to have a house with windows. Now the wind can't blow in. Glass. Children, do you know what most windows are made of? Yes, they're made of glass. When it's cold and snow is falling and we want to stay inside, we can watch the snow through windows and stay warm and happy and dry. Between us and pretty snowflakes is a window that's see-through. We can still see everything and it's warm and toasty too. We sometimes drink from glasses and milk comes in glass bottles too. It's sometimes used in pictures and it's good to keep it clean. Goldfish bowls are made of glass so the fish can all see out. Glass is very, very useful and you'll see it all about. Now one thing we must be careful of when touching any glass It's that glass is very fragile and can very easily smash We must be very careful and handle it with care It's always best to ask for help and have an adult there We must be very careful and handle it with care It's always best to ask for help and have an adult there Champions! Look over there! Some scooters! I've got a scooter! Be careful, you two! What's wrong, children? I want to have a ride on the scooter. Me too. Oh, I'm sure you do. But there are only two scooters. <laughs> I'm the champion! I'll catch you! Oh, Chi-Chi, badminton is meant to be played with friends. Yes. Can you count the number of rackets you have? One, two. So you have a racket for... My friend! <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Let's play ba da badminton. Aha! Let's play! <laughs> Would you like this? And can I please have that? Uh, here you go. Me too. Can I have a go, please? Off we go! <laughs> ding, ding, ding! <laughs> I'm the champion! <laughs> Our children are true champions. Champions at friendship and also champions at sharing. The number two. One, two, three, four, five. To find out the amount, you should learn to count. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Four numbers are before. After five, there are some more. Shout it loud, please, do. All together, number two. Here's one block. And one more. So, how many blocks do you have now? Two. And I have two. Two balloons. And two balls. A cow has two horns. An elephant has two tusks. And a bird has two wings. Two feet. Two hands. Hey, be careful where you land. Two eyes. Two ears. We're a team to keep us clean. You, you have, have to wash two of that, two of, two of this. That's just the way it is. Two rackets are better than one. Two burgers are better than one. Having one friend is better than none. When there are two of you, it's more fun. Who's there? <laughs> uh, <ooh>. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, children. Hi. Hello there. Hello. What beautiful houses, Pandy and Rosie. Where's yours, Crashy? Oh, I'll build it now. It'll be just like a real house. <laughs> ooh, ooh, can we help you? <laughs> I can do it myself. <laughs> there, in my house. How do you get out of your house, Crashy? Oh, I don't know. Help! Huh? <laughs> Who's there? It's me, Crashy. I'm inside. Come on out, Crashy. I can't. I forgot to make a door. <laughs> a house must have a door, Crashy. Hmm, I know. <laughs> there, a door. Wow. Uh, 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 no. Don't worry, Crashy. Now we have the door. What else do we need for your house? A window, so we can look outside. <laughs> there. <laughs> Ooh. A wall. My house needs a wall. <laughs> Who's there? It's me. And me, Rosie. Come on in. Uh, uh, We've made a great house, but... It's too small. There's no room for us. Bye-bye, Crushy. Wait. Wait, I have an idea. What is it? Let's build a new house. A really big house for all of us. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha!
<laughs> You've done a great job. You work together to build this beautiful house. Our homes. Uh, where are you going, Chi-Chi? On an adventure. To the sea or the mountains? To our house. In a house with wooden walls Or a building with a hundred floors There are lots of rooms to play in And lots of rooms to stay in Hide or look, cut or cook So many things to do in the bedroom there's the bed The perfect place to rest your head Under the stars that twinkle at night Till they fade at morning light In the kitchen there's food to eat Are you hungry? Take a seat A cook has so much work to do But there's always time to clang a spoon or two Delicious food is there For everyone to share down in the bathroom is where we wash Hear the water splish, splash, splash Let the water pour, but keep it off the floor Splashing makes us laugh if it's in the bath In a house with wooden walls Or a building with a hundred floors There are lots of rooms to play in And lots of rooms to stay in Having fun all day long in our happy home Having fun all day long in our happy home That's us! The Rules Hello, girls! Hello, Hello there. there! And welcome to the museum! <laughs> Ah, a museum. What an interesting place to visit and look around. <laughs> hey, hello, hello there. You can't, you can't play, play ball, ball in here. here. What do you mean I can't? We are playing museum. How do you play that? Like this. This is so boring. <laughs> Silly museum. I can't play ball there. No, you can't play ball in a museum, Crashy. But you can look at the paintings and try to guess what the artist was thinking when they made them. I love museums. All right, I'll go and take a look. It's a picture of food. So the artist was hungry? Stop that! You're only meant to look. It's OK. We are not in the museum anymore. Where are we? Welcome, Crashy, to our cafe! Hmm. Would you like some cereal? Uh, no thanks. I've already had breakfast. I'm going to play with my ball. Oh. It's a cafe now. That's wonderful. What an interesting new game the girls are playing. You can have a snack and a chat with your friends in a cafe. You can't do this, you can't do that. I don't know what I can do. It's just a different game with different rules. But how do you play it? Why don't you watch and find out? Crashy, hmm? Crashy, come over here and bring your ball. It's a whole field. And there are lines and a goal. It's a stadium. Welcome to our wonderful new stadium. When you're at the stadium, you need to clap. And blow horns. And play ball. <laughs> Let's go home. Welcome aboard Crashy's bus. Please sit down and fasten your seatbelts. That's right, Crashy. Just like the games you were playing, public transport has rules too. Drive safely. Behaving in public. It's difficult when you're little to know just what to do. You want to make people happy, but you want to have fun too. You can't always play when you'd like to, it's just not safe for you. There are rules that you must play by. There are rules that you must play by. You must.
Just give them a try. Outside on the streets, with the traffic rushing past, hold on to your parents' hand and just don't go so fast. There are rules inside a museum for all you girls and boys. You mustn't run, only walk, and try not to make a noise. But outside in the playground, we can shout and stomp around. When we're outside in the playground, we can have fun and run around. The rules really aren't that tricky. You will learn them very quickly. They are there to keep you safe. So it's easy when you're little to know just what to do. You can still make people happy. And have lots of fun too. You can't always play where you'd like to. It's just not safe for you. There are rules that you must play by. There are rules that you must play by. You must give them a try. That's us. Pirates. Hello, children. Are you enjoying your dinner? Hello. Hello. Yes, thank you. Pandy, why have you wrapped a napkin around your head? I'm not Pandy anymore. I'm a pirate. This is what pirates wear. Hey! I'm a pirate too. And me. Ah, so everyone is a pirate today. What do pirates do? Um. Will you have to find a pirate ship? Yes, after dinner. And... <laughs> Oh, my hands are all dirty. <laughs> your napkin is on your head, Rosie. Real pirates don't use napkins. They wipe their hands wherever they want. <laughs> <laughs> my hands were the only parts of me that were dirty. Now I'm dirty all over. Pirates are always dirty. Ah! What do pirates do when they want something? But it belongs to someone else. I'll show you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Wally, you didn't drink all the juice, did you? Not quite. OK, then, let's share the rest of it out. That's a great idea, Chi-Chi. No, that's a bad idea. You should give it to me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Rosie. It was an accident. <laughs> Let me help you. So you're good pirates who help each other? Uh, we're not pirates hmm? anymore. We're nice, polite sailors. Well, you are the dirtiest sailors I've ever seen. Are you sure you're not pirates? No, we're sailors. Let's go and get washed. <laughs> <laughs> it's so nice being clean again. Now I'm really hungry. Well, since you aren't pirates anymore, you can go back to your dinner. But now you will have to eat like nice sailors. And do you know the first rule when you are at the dinner table? No messing around at all. That's right. Now enjoy your meal, sailors. Table manners. <laughs> Did you children get dirty? No, we got hungry. <gasps> We've washed our hands and sat down. And you've tied around my napkin. We are ready now to begin. Table manners are called etiquette. Etiquette. Wash your hands, you know how. Sit up nicely now. Enjoy your meal and eat it up Just like a grown-up Just like a grown-up Beep beep, beep beep, beep beep, beep beep Yum! Oh. Tell me, children, what should you not do at the table? <laughs> what are you saying, Wally? Playing with our food what do you think, Chi-Chi? Making a mess. That's right. And when we do make a mess, we need to use... Um, our napkins. 
chickens. Good. And anything else? Speaking with our mouths full. Well done, Wally. There are rules to eating at the table. Which you must follow if you're able. The rules are easy to get. Because it's basic etiquette. Etiquette. Don't be late. Sit up straight. If you make a mess, clean it up. <laughs> Clear the table when you're done, just like a grown-up. Clear the table when you're done, just like a grown-up. And us! A fairy tale. Oh, hello, Wally. Oh, hello there. What are you making there? It's a book. A fairy tale about me. <laughs> Once upon a time, Wally lived. Wally lived where? In a fairy tale. I want to be in the fairy tale too. Hello, Rosie. Huh? Hello there. I want to be in the fairy tale too. Oh no, there are no more pages. You're right. The book is too thin. <gasps> Why don't you add another page? Ah, <laughs> uh -huh, that looks great. Uh, could I could I be hmm? in the fairy tale too? I'd be a dragon. Dragon! <laughs> wow! A book with a dragon and a princess. Where am I? Hold on. What are you going to be? Uh, Maybe a wizard? Yay! A <laughs> wizard! Oh, uh, uh, he that tickles! <laughs> what game are we playing? We're making a fairy tale book. Crushy is a wizard, Rosie's a princess, and I'm a dragon. <laughs> hmm. If I'm a dragon too, that means we have two dragons. <laughs> This book is really thick. It's so oh. thick. Ready for our special fairy tale? Once upon a time, there was a wizard, two dragons, <gasps> Rosie the princess, and Wally. Oh. <laughs> Good night, children. Thick and thin. Pandy, which of these ropes is thin? This one. Right. And which one is thick? This one. Behind a thick oak tree you can hide one, two, three. Behind a tree so thick and stout not a single thing sticks out. When playing hide and seek, a game you cannot win. If you hide behind a tree that is too thin. Thin one. Ooh, a thick one. Wow, look at this one. Very, very thick. <laughs> On a branch so thick and round, birds are flapping up and down. So thick it doesn't shake, it will surely never break. Another branch bends because it's thin and it is weak. The birds will have to find another seat. The mighty oak grows high up into the air. Its thick branches growing here and there. The maple tree so delicate with branches that are thin. Thin, so thin, just like a guitar string. 
just like a guitar string. That's us! Two Chi Chi's. Hello, children! Yay! Hello there! Hello there! We have a helicopter. I'm flying it. And I go and get it. Crashy, let's play. Sorry, I can't. I'm already playing. We're Chi Chi. Playing with Chi Chi? It's not fair. <laughs> My turn to fly it. Great! Now it's my turn to get it! <laughs> huh? <laughs> Crashy! Hey, Crashy! Let's play now! No, we need to wait for Chi Chi! But that's me! I'm Chi Chi! You aren't Chi Chi! It's you, Pundy! Chi 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 Chi! I have the same voice as Chi Chi! The same glasses and paws! Oh, my paws! Hmm! Wait a moment! Huh? <laughs> Pandy, are you trying to become Chi Chi? Uh huh. There it is. Pandy, wait a minute. How did you know it was me? Look, now I even have paws just like Chi Chi. You have a bow, just like Pandy wears, and Chi Chi has spikes. Hmm, I need spikes. <laughs> what do you think? <gasps> Pandy! Now you look just like Chi Chi! How amazing! Look everyone, there are two Chi Chi's! Oh yes, I'm Chi Chi and I'm ready to play! <gasps> oh! <gasps> We can't reach. Oh, I wish Pandy was here to help us. I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> Thank you, Pandy. I'm not very good at being Chi Chi. And Chi Chi can't climb like that. You're really good at being Pandy. <laughs> I think you are all great at being yourselves. Me. Hi, children. Who will you draw today? I will draw me. Who's that in the mirror looking back? Who is that? A happy, friendly person. Who is that? So many different faces From so many different places The world is such a wondrous place to be <laughs> Me, me, me Me, me, me <laughs> Pleased to meet you, this is me Pleased to meet you, this is me Who's that, children? That is me! I'm Crashy! And I love running and jumping really, really high! And this is me! I am Rosie! I have a ponytail and I love to dance! This is me and Chi Chi! And we're friends! This is us with Marsha! Marsha is a little girl. She is three years old. And she really loves to dance, sing and to draw! And to play ball with all of us! You are your parents, little star. You are loved for who you are. Your inner beauty is what they see, and surely everyone will agree. There is no one better you can be. Me, me, me. Me, me, me. Pleased to meet you, this is me. <laughs> me, me, me. Me, me, me. Pleased to meet you, this is me. <laughs> Food train. <laughs> Let's, Let's go. go! Hello, children. Hello. Hello, Hello there. <laughs> Which way are you going to go, children? This way or that way? Why don't we go and have lunch first? I don't want any lunch. Oh, no. Not pasta again. We've already had our lunch. 
Mm hmm Yesterday. Hmm. Well, where should we go then? How about to the shop? To the shop? What is that? A shop is a place where you buy things. And we can go to the shop that sells food. I want to go to the shop. Uh, OK. Ha! To the Yay! shop! To the <laughs> shop! <laughs> Next stop, the shop. We are Yay! here! Oh, wow. See if you can find some vegetables that we can put into a salad. Cucumbers. Tomatoes. And look. A cucumber, a tomato and lettuce. Great choices. Oh, a carrot. Carrots. Great. <laughs> we can have carrot soup for the first course. That will be tasty, won't it? Yes. <laughs> Ooh, what have you got there? Oh, chicken and rice. That will be perfect for the main course. Look at that. A whole lunch on wheels. On wheels? Yes. The train is loaded up with everything we need for lunch. Oh, no! Uh, it won't uh, fit! Uh, 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 Rosie, you remembered the dessert. But there's no more room on the train. What shall we do? <laughs> now we have dessert. I'm a pear. Eat me up. <laughs> <laughs> when are we going to eat our lunch? Yes, when? Right now. Let's go. <laughs> Next stop, lunch. <laughs> Well done, children. You even remembered to wash your hands. Now enjoy your lunch. Lunch. Where are you going, children? It's almost lunchtime. And we're going to cook. When you've been playing hard all morning and you feel a little weary, <laughs> do not sleep. Energy is what you need to help you think more clear. It's time to eat. When there's still so much to do and the day is halfway through. Wherever you are, whoever you are, stop what you're doing and do some chewing. Take a rest and have some lunch. It's the meal that's best. It's lunch. So, <laughs> what are we having for lunch? First course is vegetable soup. And I call it Pandy Super Soup. Next, fish and potatoes. Yum! This is the main course. And the last course is... Rosie's Berry Smoothie. That's dessert. When there's still so much to do And the day is halfway through Wherever you are, whoever you are, stop what you're doing and do some chewing. Take a rest and have some lunch. Wherever you are, whoever you are, stop what you're doing and do some chewing. Take a rest and have some lunch. It's the meal that's best. It's lunch. That's us! Hide and seek. Children? I wonder where everyone is. <gasps> I know. The children are playing hide and seek. Now then, where would Crashy hide? Hmm, let me think. Crashy loves to hop and jump and can often be seen rushing here and there. He gets so excited about everything that he sometimes forgets to be kind to his friends. But he always says sorry and tries again when he gets things wrong. Ah, I think I know where Crashy is hiding. Oh, hello there. Hello. Now, where is Chi-Chi hiding? Chi-Chi is calm and always tries to be a good friend. He likes things to be nice and neat and loves to play quiet games. Chi-Chi can sometimes even be a little bit shy. So it's great that his friends help him to join in. 
Oh, I think I've found someone. <laughs> Hello there. Hello, Chi-Chi. Do you know where Rosie is hiding? Rosie is very confident and really likes to be the leader. She loves to dress up and has great ideas that she is happy to share with her friends. She can get quite upset sometimes when things aren't perfect, but would never be unkind on purpose. Spending time with her friends helps Rosie to be happy. Oh, there she is. Next, let's look for Wally. Wally is very creative. He loves to draw and he always helps when someone is sad. Sometimes Wally can get a bit sad. There are times when you just need to be with your friends because they can make you laugh and feel happy. Wally! Hello! <laughs> Let me see who's missing. Why, Pandy, of course. How could we forget our cheerful little friend? Pandy likes to be right in the middle of everything and has a big imagination. Pandy is always fun, but she does need to learn to be a bit more careful at times. So, where is Pandy hiding? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five children. That's everyone. Great game of hide and seek, children. <laughs> Let's draw the baby Ricky. A round little pink nose. Long blue ears. Who could this be? Crashy! <laughs> That's right. The first one is Crashy. Hi! The next one has purple hair and wears round glasses. Who is it? Chi-Chi! Well done. The second one is Chi-Chi. Oh, hello. A little pink snout, a ponytail and four pink hooves. Can you guess who this is? Rosie! Rosie. Number three is Rosie. Well done. Lots of lovely soft wool and a little purple nose. Who is it? Wally! Right again. Number four is Wally. Oh, hello there. She wears a big bow and has black and white fur. Do you know who it is? Pandy! Well done. Pandy makes five. Hi! <laughs> That's everyone. Great work! Happy, happy, happy everyone is playing together. One, two, three, four, five. Five children. That's us! Knock, knock. Hello, children. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. What are you doing? Uh, it looks huh? like Wally is feeling sad. Can you think of a way to cheer him up? I can. Let's go and play. No, I'm going to sit right here. All right. You sit there. I'll come and visit you. Knock, knock, knock. Is Wally at home? Huh. <sighs> Rosie, you know it's more fun playing knock-knock if the house you're visiting has a front door. Hmm? <gasps> there! A door! Uh, Rosie, you can come in. Wally, hmm? why don't you ask who's there? It might oh. not be Rosie at the door. Yes, but I can see Rosie's ponytail. Hmm. That's because the door is a square and it is not very tall. We need a bigger door. A big tall one. Hmm. <gasps> Look, Wally. Rosie has used two squares and when put together they make a rectangle. So that's a rectangle? Who's there? It's visitors. 
visitors. Oh, it's you, Rosie. Come in. I didn't come alone. I have cake. Oh, who's there? Come in, Pandy. Oh, that's not fair. How did you know it's me? The balloon. To hide the balloon, you need a rectangle-shaped door that's even taller. Yes, taller! <laughs> Who's there? It's the bears. We are here. You, you can come on in, bears. Here we come. Here comes the bears. <laughs> <laughs> well done, children. Not only have you learned about a new shape, but you have also cheered Wally up. <laughs> rectangles. Objects shaped like rectangles are all around. Once you start to look, you know that they'll be found. Simply look and you will see. You don't have to believe me. A door within a wall, a bookcase, nice and tall. A book is a rectangle even when you open it. Rectangles all around, just look and they'll be found. This is a rectangle. And now it's a square. And now a rectangle again. Look there. The chest of drawers is a square. Look, the bookcase is a rectangle. This book is a square. Uh -uh. This book is a rectangle. Objects shaped like rectangles are all around. Once you start to look, you know that they'll be found. Simply look and you will see. You don't have to believe me. Photographs on the wall, rectangles one and all, pictures hanging in a frame, rectangles just the same. Draw a square and then another side by side and then connect to create a rectangle that's perfect. 